Hey, what's going on, guys? This is Tuba Player Negative AE, and today we are playing more Dog and Europa 2 Goodbye Despair. Biakio, why are you bringing me out here? Alright, this is the kitchen. We have to thoroughly inspect it to make sure there's no dangerous items. Thoroughly, huh? Uh, Biakio stopped into the kitchen, I followed after him. This seems dangerous. Listen. Let's get on with it then. Search this place thoroughly. We'll be searching the whole kitchen from one end to the other. Hmm. Look, I found these. There are forks and knives on that shelf. Yeah. Don't tell me those too. How are we supposed to eat? Naturally. These are definitely dangerous items. If you're just eating, uh, chopsticks are enough. He took the forks and knives and threw them into the dining case, one after the other. Being very thorough about this. Yeah, that's a good. Like what? I agree. What? Out of the question. Knives are far too dangerous. Hand them over to me. I'll safeguard them. The knife in my hand threw it in the rest. Of course. Is there anything else dangerous in here? There's a huge piece of meat on the bone. Could have got fired up. I even know if he would be able to eat that much food. I see. Like that skewer and that's how that, that appears to be the case. We wouldn't have known what to do if he said fish bones and meat bones were also dangerous items. That's what I was thinking. It's like, if he says that they're dangerous. Uh, this paper is it appears to be equipment list for the kitchen. 20 knives, or 20 forks, 20 knives, 20 spoons, 5 iron skewers, five, 3 frying pans, 20 wine glasses. There are also iron plates for the barbecue. And even a portable stove for cooking hot spots, or hot hmm. pots. Iron plates on a portable stove. I do recall seeing on the salt shelf over there. This kitchen seems to be well kept. There should be no problems using it. Though this building is old, the kitchen is impressive. Compared to a normal restaurant, it's not too shabby. Very strange. But it's strange. Uh, one of the items on this list seems to be short by one. Can I leave? Because I feel like... Is it the knives? Is it the knives? It's probably the knives, huh? Okay, Biakio what? Is it necessary to go this far? Hey, I'm doing this because it is necessary. Uh, if I'm to fill the promise I made to not let anyone become a victim, I must be extra vigilant. Vigilant. Really? Is that all? What? What do you mean? Well, I'm just assuming, but I think something must have happened to you. After all, you decided to throw a party so suddenly. I can't help but think that there's a reason for that. Hmm. That's not it. I've been a distrustful person for as long as I can remember. Distrustful person? Oh. I don't really like to talk about my past, but fine, I'll just tell you a little bit of it. I cannot talk to others about my past. I suspect my, uh, that my skeptical nature is partly to blame. Okay, he has a past he can't hmm. talk about. Um, dis distrusting others and being distrusted in turn. For a long time, my life has been a living hell. It's inevitable that it would end up. I would end up <laughs> this way. But in this kind of situation, my skeptical nature uh, might be of good use. If you were to survive here, skepticism is necessary at all costs. Oh, good, great. That's me. That's all That's me. Uh, now is not the time. However, one day there will be a, a time when I will definitely be able to hmm. tell you about it. If nothing happens and time passes for us peacefully, I will have no choice but to talk. That sounded pretty deep. Uh, I feel like something's more mysterious now because he hasn't told me the whole story. The guy might have a deep story hidden within him, deeper than I thought he'd have. That's silly talk. Hey, enough with the unnecessary banter. You better hurry and find the rest of those dangerous items. Got it. Even so, he makes us work hard. That's probably more in line with his actual personality. <gasps> The kitchen's a mess. What happened here? Stop talking. Don't raise your annoying voice. I just removed all the dangerous items. Huh? There are no knives or forks? Why? How come? Don't make me repeat myself. I literally just said I removed all of the dangerous items. You're kidding, Don't right? tell me you're treating cooking utensils like dangerous items. No, 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 no. Well, most of the dishes are, unfi or dishes are unfinished. All I gotta do is arrange the plates, so it's not a problem, but... But still... <laughs> Haji, man. Stop it. Get off of me. Not into that sort of thing, huh? Well, that's a little depressing. <laughs> Trust me, I'm the one who's depressed here. 
Before you start getting all flirty, let me explain this. I checked the equipment list and it seems there, uh, there seems to be one iron skewer missing. Mm -hmm. That's right. As far as I know, that's been missing from the start. No matter how this, uh, clean this place gets, stuff is still bound to go missing in an old building, right? Shots. If it's been missing all along, then we can't really do anything about it, right? <laughs> You're right. There's no place to hide such a long skewer anyway. Very well. All I need to do is keep a watchful eye. Don't mean... Uh, don't tell me you plan to watch or keep a watchful eye all night long. Let's go. Alright, let's go back. The others should be waiting for us. You two, Teteru, come to the dining hall for now. Uh, <laughs> okay. Jeez, he's such a pushy leader. I agree, but it, you know, he probably thinks that something's gonna happen tonight. Uh, ah, they're finally back. Hey. hey, let's eat already. I'm starving. Hmm. There's still an issue we need to address first. Lies. Huh? An issue? Oh, right. Alright, who do I gotta... Who do I gotta beat the crap out of? Just say the word and I'll do it for That's you. That's enough. That won't be necessary. The issue is to safeguard this domain case that has confiscated all the dangerous items. We can't just leave it here? Or leave it here? I've already put a lock on the case so it shouldn't be a problem, but... We should definitely keep, uh, up the security and keep it someplace safe. Um. Someplace safe? Oh, there's a storage room in the back of this old building. I see. A storage room, huh? Even so, we can't uh, leave the case alone in there. Then... Then someone should safeguard it. Uh, that would keep it safe, yes? Huh? Why? Why would you send someone to safeguard it? What? I'll do it, of course. Uh... <laughs> Are you sure? I guess if you insist. Uh, just kidding. Aww. Why? We ha you have no weapon. Like, there's no way you're going to stop the guy. But it'll be lonely there by uh, by yourself. I don't mind. I don't mind. I'm really not uh, that good in situations where I have to be lots of, around lots of people anyway. Girl, I don't know. If I, if I wrote a song about this, the title would definitely be Lonely Girl in the Storage Room. However... However, Tedaru has gone through the trouble of cooking. Is it alright for me to bring some of it with me? Okay! Yeah, that's totally fine. What? But if you're going to, uh, to guard... If you're going to do guard duty anyway, it might be better if you avoid the storage room. Why is that? Well, not only is the storage room packed with lots of stuff, it's really hard to see in there and full of cobwebs. <laughs> also, I was busy cleaning the dining hall, so I wouldn't, so I didn't even have time to clean the storage room. If you stayed in there for a long time, I think it would be bad for your health. I see. In that case, why don't you guard it in the office? If I recall correctly, there's also a circuit breaker in there. It'd be a good idea to guard that as well. Yep. Yeah, the office sounds nice. I'm pretty sure it's not that dirty either. Understood. Understood. So I need to be on guard duty at the office. And I should get going. Have fun tonight, everyone. Why is she... I mean, does she still have that weapon? Is that... Is that, like, just for show? Or is that, like, she has a bamboo weapon? Becca left the dining hall. I see. I see. Uh, sh seeing Pekko's back as she walks away... Uh, makes me feel like she's got a the super cool melancholy huh? vibe. But shouldn't we have taken that other case with her too? <laughs> this? No, this case is fine. That's weird. That's no fair. You're like the only one who got to bring their own stuff. Naturally. When you're as special as me, you get special privileges. <laughs> when you put it that way, it's hard. What? That makes it, it makes it Listen. extremely easy to argue with you, dude. The Jeweler Man case stays with me at all times. I've put the key in the other case as well, uh, in here as well. I'll take full responsibility of watching over it, and there's no way I can let anyone else handle this matter. <sighs> more importantly, we're all done now, right? Let's start the party. Stop talking. No, there's still more. I'm gonna do it! Ugh, who do you want me to beat the crap out of? Hurry up and tell me already. Seriously, it has nothing to do with that. Hmm. Actually, if you're volunteer, uh, volunteering, I do have one particular nuisance in mind. Huh? Are you talking about... That's right. Monokuma, of course. He's the one thing that could obviously disrupt this party. I'll show you my serious All side. All right. So you let me eat if I beat the crap out of Monokuma, right? Hold on! Wait a sec. If you actually pick a fight with that thing, you're just going to end up, uh, perforated. No! Perforated. You're telling me to wait till I starve to death? Hey. Starve to death? That's a little extreme. <laughs> Our opponent is not someone we can just fight. Uh, rather, it would be better if we use our heads and think of a plan. Uh, hey, hey. I'll do something about it. What? Do something. You. Hey, hey. Hey, what could a girl like you do? You're 
just gonna put yourself in danger. Nope. I won't. It's not like I'll personally do something. You won't? <laughs> do you intend to utilize Monami? Yep. Yeah, if I can talk her into helping us, she might be able to keep Monokuma at bay. At least, that's what I think. <gasps> that's probably a good idea. She looks like the type that that's easily manipulated. Plus, Monami and Monokuma totally have a rivalry going on. <laughs> well, it's a pretty one-sided rivalry. Are you okay? Uh, but will you really be okay, Chikaki? I, th I still think it's dangerous. It's gonna be fine. Uh, it'll be fine. If things get dangerous, I'll just run away as fast as I can. Well then, I'll be going now. Dots. What is this feeling? I feel uneasy. Okay, who's gone? Uh, Sword Lady's gone. For good. Wait. Where is Nurse Lady? It's not like I have a bad feeling about this, but something feels off. So it's all settled, right? Then can we... <laughs> You're right, let's begin. <laughs> Alright! Fine. So the banquet has finally commenced. <laughs> you better keep me entertained. And with that, the party started. Now that I think about it, I still don't understand why we're even having a party in the first place. Okay, there's Nurse Girl. She's right there, um, in the back. But whatever the reason, everyone seems to be having fun. Hey, are we good? Can I finally eat? You're already eating! <laughs> I, I can't stop! <laughs> I can't stop my hands from shoving food in my face! You're so violent. Well, of course you can't stop. These are the world's tastiest party dishes, after all. No matter <laughs> how full you feel, you can't help but continue eating such exquisite delicacies. That is what I cook, the world's tastiest dishes. Th that's rather scary. What? You're not eating? Then I'm gonna eat all this by myself! I'll make lots more in the kitchen, and then I'll bring it all out here, okay? Hey, everyone. While we're at it, why don't I take pictures for you guys? Okay. Wow, that sounds wonderful. Snap. Snap. This feels weird. When I first came to this island, watching everyone having fun was so frustrating. But now it feels reassuring. We're actually friends who fight together. Uh, we're friends who have de developed a sense of unity. Hey, Neku hmm. Nekumaru, did something happen? The party just started, but... I must return to my cottage. Come on. Don't be foolish. I won't allow such selfish actions. Don't stop me! <laughs> okay. It would shame me as a man. Sure. Shitting my pants would be would totally shame me as a man. So he was talking about the toilet. We need to use the bathroom, there's one in this old cottage building. Why do you need to build or one in this old building? Why do you need to go back to your cottage? <laughs> I've been trying to use it many times, but the door just won't open at all. What? What is this blasphemy? <laughs> what now? Impossible! My hellhound here has disappeared. Did it vanish into subspace? Sure! Oh, shit. Quiet! Shut up, don't you dare. Is it alright? Let you all right? Don't be needed. Make sure you leave some for me. Come on! I'm gonna take a Say picture. Cheese. Say cheese! Why can't you all act a little more mature? What? What was that sound just now? I knew it. I knew the power was gonna go out. I was like, I, I saw that breaker in the room, and I was like, someone's gonna turn off that power. So, hold on. The gamer left, and what's her name left, and the bamboo sword Neko girl, um, or whatever her name is, she left. And everybody else was trying to leave, but they didn't leave yet. Zap, dots, dots. Huh? It's dark all of a sudden. It's a blackout! Blackout? A blackout? Hey, I can't see anything! In that instant, we stumbled around in the darkness. Uh, our fear swallowed us up like a flood. It's pitch black! My future is pitch black! Sounds of frantic footsteps raging, uh rang throughout the dark dining hall, and we were immediately swallowed up by another sound. Uh, everyone, crawl down! We gotta stay calm in a situation like this! Ah! Step on my feet! 
What the hell? What's going on here? I'm trying to recognize everybody's voices because it's all question mark. Because the windows were entirely covered, the blackout surrounded us with complete darkness. Complete darkness. Therefore, no matter how long I wait, there's no way my eyes will adjust. This, this is... Ow! Turn the damn lights on! I can't eat like this, you know! Okay, that's... What's her you name? You guys? Where are you? Wasn't the blackout just in the kitchen? Perhaps the breaker overloaded? Hold on a sec. I'll go along the wall and do something about it. We fervently waited to be released from our fear. We anciently waited, and after a while, it finally... I don't see her. I don't see her. At that moment, the lights sort of finally turned back on. A shocking scene unfolded before our eyes. That is... Mikan's appearance had been compromised? Oh. <laughs> Seriously? Seriously, how do you how trip do you and land, land like, like that? that? Yeah, I'm honestly confused. Yay! An erotic pose! That's obviously a fan service moment. Thank you. Dad, no! Please don't! Please don't look at me! <laughs> I can't take this at all! My hero! It's time to snatch some shots! What? There, there's no way I can do that! Uh, why don't you just get up, girl? Everyone, I think it would be best if we help her already. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm terribly sorry for all this trouble. So sorry. Hey. From now on, just be careful. Huh? Oh, I'm glad the lights are back on in here too. Yay! So you were the one that fixed the breaker, Kazuichi. You were you, you were unusually useful this time. Hey. Uh, well, no. I couldn't find my way to the office with the circuit breaker. Huh? Uh, th then why are the lights back on? <laughs> who knows? What? Are you stupid? Don't who knows me. You're so useless. <laughs> it's not my fault, you know. There's no way I could have found the off my way uh, to the office with that in that darkness. Oh, my. Oh, my. What happened? Sonia, did something happen? Um... No, but Biakia is missing. Did he go somewhere? Huh? Oh, I hope he's dead. No, the only reason I <laughs> the only reason I hope he's dead is because he's the he was the one that I suspected the most because he was the leader. Immediately, sure enough, Byakya, who promised he would lead us in situations like this, was nowhere to be found. Huh? That's weird. He was here earlier, right? Um. Did he run off somewhere d d during the blackout in that pitch blackness? Hey. A little worried. Uh, we sh we should split up and go look for him. I'll go into the storage room, so can I ask uh, you to check the entrance, Hajime? Yeah, I got it. For now. Then I guess I'll go look in the office. Then... I'll sh uh, I shall go look around in the hallway. Oh, I'll stay here oh, since I'm kind of in the middle of eating anyway. She's still going to eat while this is going on? Mm. I must bathroom. Sure. I must man up and check the bathroom. I don't, <laughs> I don't understand this man up Jeez. thing. Jeez, Mr. Ham Hands ran away just because there was an itty bitty blackout? <laughs> such a shameful leader. If I find him, I'm gonna finger flick him in the face as punishment. Even so, where did Byakia go? I believe I have to go check the entrance. I'm pretty sure Chikaki was there. Alright, so, um... I honestly... I honestly don't care what you have to say. Actually, I do. Uh, what are you doing? You aren't going to use the bathroom? Yes, but it appears someone else is using it. And the door's been shut since the party even started. Damn you, the bathroom is for everyone. How dare you hog it? Someone's been using the bathroom since the party even started. That's what it looked like. No matter how many times I checked it, it never seems to open. It's bad. Oh shit, I'm going to shit. The more I try to hold it in, the more it wants to come out. Come on, you can do it. Uh, even so, there has to be... That's a long time to be in the bathroom. Who's in there? And... If they've been in there since the, before the party started, it can't be Byakia. It, the only one that wasn't at the party was uh, Fushikyo. Right? Nagito. Sorry. 
Oh, sorry to surprise you. Oh, yeah, you were looking around yep. in there. Yeah, Byaki isn't in there. I wonder where he is. Can I go in there, though? Hajime. I feel like you're hiding something. I'm suspicious of everybody. Huh. I wonder. Um. I searched the hallway, but there's no sign of Byakia. Where did he go? Is he outside? I haven't looked yet. I'll go check. This is weird. Dots. Dots. Chikaki and Manami are standing in front of the entrance. I guess they're watching out for Monokuma. Huh? Hajime, what about the party? Oh. It's not done yet, right? I haven't even joined in yet. Hey, Chikaki, did you happen to see Byakia pass by here? Nope. Uh, Byakia? Nope, I didn't. But what happened to Byakia? There was a sudden blackout in the old building and Byakia vanished during that time. So we thought he might have gone outside, but... No, it's... Nope, nobody came out. If nobody came out, does that mean he's still inside? If that's the case, we must have missed each other. I think. That's what I think. Hey. Hey, Hajime, how'd it go? When I talked to Shikaki, she said, uh, he didn't go outside. That's... That, that's weird. No one was inside the storage room either. Hmm. It wasn't in the kitchen, obviously. Hmm. No one was in the office. It is strange, Wait. no? That is strange. Where is the girl who's supposed to be in the office? That's weird. What about Pekko? I thought she was supposed to be guarding that area. Hey. Actually, not even Pekko was there. Huh? Pekko's gone too? Hmm. Maybe those two took advantage of the blackout to have themselves a major makeout session in the bathroom? Well done. Snort, snort. Truly, truly outrageous. Hmm. Um. Did something happen, Akane? It smells. Do any of you smell something? Well, partially digested food is absorbed by the small intestine and it's decomposed by bacteria, releasing gas, which is mostly absorbed in the intestinal tract, but whatever cannot be absorbed is excreted from the anus. Yes! Those are the mechanics of farting, but farting isn't something to be embarrassed about. It's not like that! No, 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 that's not what I'm talking Wait. about. It smells like blood. Blood? I think this twa, uh, twitch like, nose twitch like a beast, and suddenly she pointed. <laughs> it's coming from over there. Oh, shit. The smell of blood. What in the world is at that table? It's under there. Under the table? I dashed towards the table at the back and reached out towards the cable cloth, and then I stopped. This nervousness? Fear? Why am I nervous? I can't. It can't be. It obviously can't be. There's no way that's gonna happen. With a shout, I grabbed the tablecloth and flipped it uh, back with one go. Yaki is dead. With night vision goggles, huh? Where did they get night vision freaking goggles? The supermarket? For the rest of my life, I will never forget what I saw. What I saw. The ultimate affluent progeny, Byakia Togomi, already dead and beyond recognition. <sighs> oh, jeez. It's still chapter one. Byakia? No. No! I just stood there horrified as showers of screams rang out behind me and gazed quietly as uh, the body of my former friend. Why? W why? What is this? What is this? Hey, 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 hey! Are you kidding me? What? They're just saying stuff. This can't be real blood, right? It's gotta be like jam or sauce. Because if it's not this. <laughs> What the hell? Good gracious, things took a turn for the worse. My, my, now this is interesting. Thrills, chills, kills! 
on this tropical paradise known as Jabberwock Island, the very first murder has finally taken place. M the murder? Could it be? Hold on. Then does this mean? <laughs> of course. That's right. Yakia was killed by one of you. What? Of course. If you look at the body, you can tell instantly he was obviously murdered. He has such a horrible expression on his face, don't you think? A face filled with regret that his life was ended by force. All thanks to someone's selfish desires. To have a dying face such as this. If this isn't murder, then what the heck could it be? The Akio was most likely sacrificed by someone who really wanted to leave this island. Lies. It's all lies. You're lying that he was murdered. Uh, murdered, uh, the moment I screamed that word, a thick, muddy feeling of despair swelled within my body, which means that I've accepted the fact that Byakuya was murdered. What? What is this? Could it be? Is that really Byakuya? What? Bitch? Where the fuck were you? Why? Why did this happen? Why Byakuya? The Pierce Fuyuko is, uh, is the only one who isn't here. What are you gonna do? So in the spirit of keeping everyone on the same page, why don't we go, how about we do this the usual way? A body has been discovered! Now then, after a certain amount of time has passed, the class trial will begin! Okay. <laughs> class trial. Hey, um... I've already explained this to you, right? If one of you gets murdered, the rest of you have to debate who you think is the blackened. You're telling us to figure out who the killer is? Correct! That's right. From this point on, you guys must investigate and uncover the black and culprit. That's impossible! It can't be. Someone actually killed? There's no way. <laughs> Boo hoo, if you make an outburst like that, you'll end up being a suspect. D that's... I won't believe it. One of us killed Biakia? There's no way something as hopeless as that would ever happen. No, no, no! If you're actually thinking that way, it means you guys have already. You're already, already being conned by the killer. <laughs> Come on, hurry up and let's begin. An impassioned, life-risking battle between you guys and the Blackened. And it's already started. It started the moment one of you plotted to kill someone. Hey! Hey, what are you saying? You can't! Everyone, please, you cannot and you should not believe what Monokuma says. <laughs> no matter how much you interfere, there is only ever one truth. On my grandfather's... On oh, my grandfather's name. You have a grandpa? On my grandfather's... On oh, my grandfather's grave. Hey. Grave? Your grandpa is dead? What happened to him? On my grandfather's... <laughs> my grandfather's plane. Emergency! What happened to your grandpa? Did his plane crash? You don't even know where to begin. At this rate... You ain't my comedy partner anymore. <laughs> Hurt so much when you hit me with a charging corkscrew attack. <laughs> Girl, I don't know if that's supposed to be funny, but it's just real. Like that's what happens when you punch somebody. Did you see that? That's the stunning display of my defy your big brother and I will show you no mercy. Uh, I will harden my heart and teach you a lesson you won't soon forget. <laughs> if only I had my magic stick, I'd be able to fight back against Monokuma. Fine, fine. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Let's just leave the whiny rabbit loser alone, and um, I wonder if I can fix it. I wonder if I can fix that. Have that on a lovely day, uh, doubt and dovey description. Uh, put your heart and soul into investigating. I wish you the best of luck. And at that, or with that, Monokuma vanished, leaving those of us who were grief-stricken alone with our despair. What? What does this Is mean? This? I don't understand. All right. I'm going to end it. I should have probably should have ended it black screen. But uh, thank you guys for watching. This is Tuba Player Negative AE. And uh, we'll, we'll continue the next episode next time. Uh, so thank you guys for watching. Leave a like if you liked the video. Let me know I'm doing something right. And comment if you have any suggestions or you just want to talk because I read all of those. So I uh, hope you guys are having a good rest of your day. And peace out, guys.